Hello everyone, I'm Alex K and welcome to my channel. You probably noticed that I haven't posted in about two weeks. And the reason behind that is I have been filming. And, well, filming and other uni work. And this is what I've been filming. A Whistle in the Air, a queer film about a mother who wants a perfect family, but then the son starts making these changes to himself where she isn't happy, so she goes at all lengths to try and correct him, but in the end she like discovers there's no changing him. And the message behind the film is kind of it's shown about homophobia, gender politics, and like essentially women's rights in a very narrow aspect. And it's just following like the backwards attitudes that is held in today's society. And the reason I wanted to make this film is because it's so, I wouldn't say different, but it's quite. Like, it is a comedy, and on my course there are people that have been making comedies. But this is... It's a very personal film, like, to me. And the things that are being put across in this film are things that I think people need to hear or understand. Now, the inspiration behind this film is a very interesting filmmaker and his name is John Waters. John Waters is a filmmaker from well, the 70s up to now. I don't think he's made a film in a while though. And he's made films like Pink Flamingos, Female Troubles, and most famously, Hairspray. The reason I took inspiration from his films is something he said, and it's not word for word, but he basically said, I take the piss out of people that I respect. See, I, because I'm a queer person myself, I respect the community and I find it incredibly important to get that message across. That it's alright to have a laugh, but when things are very serious in certain cases, that it needs to be addressed. And that's what people say, comedy is a way of expressing something serious in a light-hearted way. Now, here are some production stills of the film that I have made. Yeah, I hope you're enjoying these. That is me, dressed as a woman. Obviously taking inspiration from um, Divine, who is the drag queen in John Waters' film. And the end goal is to have this film in like LGBT festivals, queer festivals, stuff like that. And what I'm going to say now is it's not a great film. That's the point. Because John Waters, like, he's made amazing films, but they're in the genre of trash cinema. So they're never intended to be masterpieces, but they have a strong message. It's a film like quite similar to mine where essentially a group of friends have got together and made a film for fun with an underlying political message. Because I'm not heavily political, so I don't want it shoved in your face, but it is there. So I will have an update very soon of when it's all done and I'll give you a link to the film and that's all I have to say but my final message would be no matter who you are what you do be yourself and that, that's, that's this film A Whistle in the Air is Be Yourself film I know this is a short video and hopefully I'll see you next week if I'm not under too much pressure. And 
that's all I have for you. See you later. Going in, in the retrospect of um, queer cinema and queer culture, I would suggest going to subscribe to WoW Presents, which, if you don't know what WoW Presents is, it's where people in connection or people of queer culture, especially from um, the famous show RuPaul's Drag Race, go on to do little short shows, like every day there's something different, like different um, small series of things, and you can pr you can engross yourself in the queer community and have a laugh along with it. So go give it a look, subscribe if you want, don't forget to subscribe to me, give this a thumbs up and a comment if you have something to say. And now bye bye.